y'all Shanice welcome or welcome back to my channel so I'm coming to you guys makeup bliss no makeup on skin flawless and everything so today I'm doing a highly 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 requested video all about my body care slash hygiene routine I've been getting like so many questions like every single day or there's so many requests to do this video so here I am giving it to you guys um, share all my secrets with you for flawless beautiful radiant skin and honestly a lot of you guys think my skin is perfect it is not I suffer with a lot of things myself personally like ingrown hairs which are the freaking devil and very dry skin my skin has just been dry so yeah um, those are things that I've been working on and things that I constantly work on because they always just come up and it's like I gotta deal with this so yeah I'm gonna share my tips and my secrets with you and show you guys how I get this bomb radiant skin so let's just hop right into this video hey y'all so I'm super sorry I'm keeping you waiting on this video but here it finally is so first things first is I hop in the shower and get my body wet and lubricated and then I like to use my Dr. Bronner's 18 in 1 peppermint soap which as you can see I'm almost done because I absolutely love this stuff and I also use my African net or sponge to get the job done this is a game changer so I'm just gonna put a little bit of the soap onto my rag and you can definitely dilute this because it is a little bit strong you're gonna actually feel that kind of like burning kind of cooling sensation with this soap which I personally love especially in the winter because it just makes me feel really really good and I'm just gonna scrub and exfoliate my skin with this this is an amazing exfoliator and definitely a game changer in your body care routine if you decide to add this in I actually used to use rags and loofahs and those don't clean your body the way this will and it doesn't exfoliate your body the way this will you will definitely see and feel a major difference in your skin but one of my favorite things about this sponge is that it is super long so you're going to be able to get your back very very easily so if you will suffer from back acne which i did in the past this will work wonders on your back and it will definitely help with the back acne and keeping that place clean so it can get infected and cause more pimples and the crazy thing is is that i actually cut this in half so it actually comes longer than this and if you ever want to reuse it just pop it in the washer and then you are good so I'm going to take a little bit more of the peppermint soap and I am going to get my vagina, coochie area down there. I'm also going to be taking a little bit of the soap and putting it onto my Vanity Planet Spin Brush. Y'all know how I feel about this brush. And I'm going to use that under my armpits. I'm actually using the smaller brush head just because I feel like it gets in, you know, the crevices easier and stuff like that. So this is another game changer. And if you guys want to know how I keep my armpits, you know, light and bright, this is exactly what I do. Exfoliate my armpits with this brush right here. So once that's done, I'm just going to rinse it off and then I'm also gonna do the exact same thing to you know, my coochie area, just like the top portion because that's where I am prone to ingrown hairs and I do have a little bit of scarring so that's really gonna help lighten it up and everything. And yeah, that is the struggle us women deal with, well, specifically me. Okay, so at least two times a week, I do like to use a scrub. So this is the Camille Rose Caramelized Cane Sugar Bomb. And this stuff is amazing, okay? Especially for the winter, if you are dry like myself, this is gonna work wonders on your body. It leaves it so moisturized, so shiny and radiant, and you feel amazing. You're gonna come out the shower looking like Slick Rick, okay? Slick Rick on your body. So I just like to take a lot of this and I kind of just rub it all over my body. This is not a heavy exfoliator, which I like, especially in the winter. This is perfect. It's going to add the moisture and the hydration back into my skin. So I don't know if you guys can see this, but your girl is glowing. And I'm telling you, even after I wash this off, you're going to see that my skin is just very, very radiant and shiny. And it looks very, very moisturized. So quickly, I did want to show you guys my armpits to show you guys that my routine actually works. Even though there's hairs coming through and everything, you can still see that it's pretty bright. Exfoliating your armpits on a daily basis will change your armpits for the better trust me and wax instead of shave okay so once i get out of the shower i make sure that my body is still damp before i moisturize and the moisturizer that i'll be using is the kiss my ash by gina b naturals i will leave a link down below on where you can find this but it's just a nice shea butter and this is actually the lavender scent which i like to use in the nighttime and then she also has a lemon scent which i like to use in the mornings 
and they both are really really good and work amazing on my skin my skin just really eats it up and if you guys have been following me for a very long time you would know that i only use cocoa butter and shea butter and then some oils on my skin and that's about it and that's what really gives me that healthy glow and it lasts all day long so clearly you can see that my body is still a little bit wet and this is going to make sure that the product really seeps into my body and keeps me moisturized for a longer period of time. So that's why I do that. And you want to make sure that you're taking care of those feet. You don't want to be looking shiny from the ankles up, okay? And personally for me, I also lotion my armpits and my elbows. I also feel like it aids in keeping it, you know, nice and bright. So yeah, that is pretty much my routine from in the shower to out the shower. And as you can see, my skin looks super healthy and radiant. I know it seems like a lot, but it's totally worth it. I also forgot to mention for hygiene, I do like to use the down there goodie wipes and I use this, you know, just every single day, whether I'm at home or on the go, that comes in lavender and cocoa shea. They smell really, really good. And I just wipe my, you know, vagina area with that. And then for ingrown hairs, I also use the European wax smooth me wipes just throughout the day before I take a shower or if I'm just, you know, I don't have the time to exfoliate, this is what I'll use in conjunction or just by itself. All right guys, so that is my body care routine. Hopefully you guys enjoyed that video. I do wanna get two things out of the way that I think I kind of missed in this video and that is deodorants and perfumes and oils and such. So when it comes to deodorants, I only use deodorants when I have to. I haven't found a great natural deodorant that works for me. So right now I'm using the Nivea Powder Touch Deodorant. Um, it's okay, it works, and um, like I said, I only use it when I have to, and that's usually in the mornings after my showers, when I'm you know, gonna do errands, when I'm gonna go out and such like that. If it's nighttime and I take my shower, I will usually just use my favorite oil right here, which is the Lick Me All Over, and this thing smells amazing, it smells bomb. A lot of you guys bought it for my last skincare routine and said it smells amazing. And I actually found a seller on Amazon that sells the exact same thing, Oh my gosh. Yeah, so I'll either apply an oil, just dab it on my neck and, you know, under my armpits and everything, and then I'm good for the night. I'm not a person who sweats a lot, so that's good for me. Or I'll apply like an oil like this. This is the black opium, and you just smell so sexy after this. So really just depends on how I'm feeling, but I usually go towards more of the oil. So yeah, when it comes to that part of my hygiene, this is what I do. Didn't want to leave that out because I think that is very important. Deodorant is something that definitely aids in, you know, getting dark armpits. I used to use deodorant all the freaking time and I noticed that my armpits were like super, super dark and I'm just like, no. So after I stopped using it less and less, I noticed a huge difference in my armpits. They were lighter and it just looked better. So yeah, hopefully you guys enjoyed this video. Hopefully it was helpful and I will see you guys all the next one. Don't forget to hit that thumbs up button. Don't forget to subscribe and deuces.